is that? Oh shit, what is that? We interrupt this program to bring you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Time to check the song. Maybe I just wanna run it up. Count that too, count it up, yeah. count it up, count it up, count it up. Lately, I just wanna run it up. What is that? Oh shit, what is that? All right, so let me explain what happened to my hair. So I wanted to dye my hair in like this gray, silverish type color. I know that I don't have to buy gray hair dye to dye my hair gray or silver. I I could just buy purple shampoo, but the one that I bought, it's only supposed to like remove the brassiness from bleached hair. It's not gonna change it to silver or anything like that. And I, I said, next time when I go out to buy purple shampoo, I'm gonna buy the one that could turn my hair into silver. But I saw this um, hair, bleach hair dye or whatever, called Ash. Right? What's Ash? It's supposed to look like ashes, brown, gray, uh, like, not brown, like gray. And I've used it before. I've used it on a wig that was the same color as my hair. So then I was like, okay, all right, I don't have to buy the purple shampoo then. So I put the the the, the thing in my hair. The um, I don't even have it right now. I put the ash in my hair, and my hair is olive green. It's brown. It got hints of gold. There is even a little bit of a blue green in there, like what's happening i look like an asparagus i look like a two-leaf clover okay so obviously my hair needs some treatments so i have some here from sutana this is what the packaging is looking like cute little drawstring bag this is really nice as well like we need we need the storage they came individually wrapped in these bubble wraps so that is good i don't have to worry about my stuff breaking and shit because we know how y'all work like y'all shipping company people like you just like we got fragile stuff in there like be careful all right so the first thing that i'm going to show you is this bergamot coconut and sesame hair mask oil this is what she is looking like so i'm just going to read the back real quick um rich in mineral uh, rich in vitamins minerals and essential fatty acids that heavily strengthen and deeply nourish and repair the hair directions as a pre-wash treatment apply generous amount and gently massage all over the dry scalp and hair leave for at least 15 minutes before rinse off with shampoo dry hair two to three times per week normal and oily hair one to two times uh, one to two times per week as a leave-in conditioner as a oh okay as a leave-in conditioner apply a small amount onto clean damp hair okay leave-in conditioner this smells so good the next one is a bergamot mint and turmeric scalp and root revival treatment and this is what this one is looking like this detoxifies buildup and impurities stimulates blood circulation nurtures and strengthens roots okay and nourishes the scalp oh that sounds so good okay divide your hair into sections apply one or two drops not for my forcey here though or <laughs> apply one to two drops to each section and massage leave for at least 15 minutes before rinse off with shampoo or apply before bedtime as a pre-shampoo treatment for irritated scalp with build up two to three times a week or a normal scalp once a week all right so i am actually gonna do the overnight treatment because i'm not gonna lie my scalp has been ridiculously irritated recently like this like this whole area right here i don't know if it's because of the um wig videos that i've been doing it's only this area though so i really think that it's the wig videos that i've been doing and i've been like ripping the wigs off and stuff like i know i'm not supposed to do that but you know we do it anyways you just rock what's on the shelf and i'm not feeling it search for the one but baby girl it's nothing real as this can't trust a soul i keep a hammer call it too legit i've been really in the field let her rush i love the feel lately i just want to run it up don't need no deals, I make the deal I have to take it to a meal Lately, I just wanna run it up Yeah mm -hmm. Time to check the song Lately, I just wanna run it up yeah, Count that too, count it up yeah. Count it up, count it up, count it up Lately, I just wanna run it up Yeah, uh, yeah uh, I just be off the dome I never own no chrome 
foes and clones. Yeah, yeah. I be at home alone. I be in zones alone. I be on road. have hair on my head for me it's the even though it's not healthy i still have hair on my head for me period baby hi how you doing like what is that oh shit what is that all right let me just do this last one real quick So I'm gonna give this roughly a day to completely dry. Y'all already know, damaged hair takes a lot longer to dry. So I'm gonna give this the rest of the day to dry and I'm gonna come back. What is that? With the finished product. All right y'all, so I'm back with my daughter and my body is gonna die. But to recap, I did the mint and turmeric scalp and root revival treatment. First, so I put a few drops of that all over my scalp and I did like a little massage and left it in for a while. I didn't do it overnight because I feel like the scent was a little too strong for my daughter. Um, if y'all don't know, I sleep with my daughter. Like I sleep next to her. So yeah, after that I shampooed my hair and then I used this, the coconut and sesame hair mask oil. I put this all over my scalp and I put some in my hair too. And <laughs> she's smiling so much right now. So I use this as a leave-in treatment, like leave-in or like a wait what? Leave-in conditioner. I, I use this as like a leave-in conditioner to get like the best results. And y'all, like this is the moment that we have been waiting for. I did some bantu knots, aka Chinese bump. If you're from Jamaica, we say Chinese bump. I don't know if you say it like like that in your country, but. In Jamaica, we say Chinese bum, bantu knots, whatever. <laughs> He's smelling so much. So I'm gonna take these out, and ah, oh, I'm low-key excited. Like I'm, not, I'm living for this look. I mean, the parts aren't bad, like you know all that. Alright y'all, so this is the finished product, the finished look, and I'm really liking it. I just need to like cut off my ends because baby girl got a lot of split ends. When I say baby girl, I'm talking about myself, but yeah, anyways, as y'all can see, I have a lot of split ends. I should have cut those off first, but I'm going to like blow dry my hair, flat iron it, all that jazz so that I can see what I really need to cut off. So yeah, that was it. Everything y'all need to know about the products that I used will be in the description down below because y'all my hair is so soft right now like you don't understand like it's soft like tiana's butt 